Alright, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back with a new episode of the Indiana Pacers My GM series. The roster's looking alright right now. Paul George, Fareed, Miles, Ellis, Hill, Hill, Green, Turner, Granger, Robinson, Allen, Young. Don't know what I'm doing like this, but whatever. Rakeem, Christmas, Jared Cunningham, alright? Um, now, a lot of you guys really wanted me to trade Monte Ellis, and I wish... I started this series a little bit later than what I did start it because Ellis, he's been balling in real life. This man, well, the other day he played really, really well. Um, and so, yeah, Monte Ellis, he's, uh, he's been playing pretty well in real life. Unfortunately, he's not that good in 2K. Let me show you his stats though. Um, his stats for this year have been... Um, 14 points per game, 5.5 assists, one steal, and uh, he has been shooting pretty well from the three point uh, as a three point percentage, but it hasn't been. Um, I mean, it ties as what his best season was um, in with Golden State. So there you go. Um, this man, he's moved around a little bit. He played a while in Golden State, Milwaukee, Dallas, and now Indiana. But um, he might be a guy that uh, that I have to look to trade. Um, I mean, he, he has been kind of playing decent the last couple of games. He didn't start, well, he got, he got 28 against Miami, but um, yeah, anyway. That's just something to think about. Might have to trade him away, but let's simulate just a few games. I want to see uh, when Gerald Green comes back. Um, so let's, let's uh, simulate um, with Simcast up against the, uh, the Detroit Pistons. And I was, uh, I was watching... Uh, a few uh, a few highlights the other day of uh, Ben Wallace because uh, I mean why not I'm a fan of Ben Wallace I like Ben Wallace and uh, this game is pretty close right now I might have to hop in the game but I was watching a few games uh, a few highlights of uh, of Ben Wallace and this man um, we're gonna lose anyway but um, the commentator that announced not the commentator the guy that announces all the players that guy is so dope the Detroit Pearson guy he's he's so dope he's like. Uh, I, I forget from Virginia University. Ba 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 Ben Wallace. That that that's just so cool, man. I I miss that guy. <laughs> this this guy George Hill didn't score. He went 0 for 12. This guy freaking went 0 for 12. I mean, he got seven rebounds, nine assists. He got five turnovers, and he went 0 for 12. What are you doing, man? Drummond got 11 and 17. This guy gets so many, so many rebounds. But I want to see how we do. Like, I don't want to keep losing these games right now. We might have to trade Monte Ellis if we're 14 and 8 and we started the series 9 and 0. That means we haven't really done very well. What kind of question is this right now? Uh, not a chance. Obviously, I'm not going to trade Paul George. 88 loyalty, 84 morale. That's pretty good right there. I'll take that for PG. We got. We take another loss. I don't know what it is. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to look at the team chemistry after this because I. I don't like how we. Uh, how we. How we keep losing games. It's not what I want to see. I want to get these W's. I don't want to lose all these games. View report. Um, ben Simmons. Obviously, we can actually have a look at his stats right now. This guy. If you don't know Ben Simmons, he's a freaking monster. Ben Simmons is a freaking monster, okay? I really like Ben Simmons. He's from Australia, by the way. But uh, I've heard of I've heard a bit about this guy. I don't know how you say his name. Czech Diallo? Where's he from? Kansas? But is he from... He, I don't know, man. But that guy looks kind of cool. I heard a little bit about him, so... Uh, I might have to do some uh, some research before I get into into uh, the draft of this year because I know a few guys. I know Ben Simmons, Jamal Murray, uh, Jalen Brown, uh, Diamond Stone. I know a few guys, um, and I know a few from you know next year's draft after that. You know, Thumb Maker and stuff like that. Joe Green is back, which is awesome. Uh, adjust the rotation. Um, that that and uh, CJ Miles, you're starting, um, and I think we're gonna have to make. Joe Green a small forward, which is something I'm gonna have to do now, I think. I'm gonna do it right now, actually. Joe Green. Um, let's see if he's, wait, hold up. How many shooting guys do we have? One, two, three. How many small forwards? 
We'll have a lot of small forwards. We have five. But Miller doesn't get any minutes. Robinson doesn't really get any minutes. But I want to keep him on the team just because... I seen him play, and he's actually not too bad. I like Robinson. Glenn Robinson the third. So I'll keep him there. Just, you know, him and uh, Rakeem Christmas. These two can stay for a little while. But, um... Yeah, let's make Gerald Green a small forward. Let's see. They, I wish they adjusted his hair. They got to adjust some players in this game. They got to adjust Andre Drummond's hair, Gerald Green's hair. Um, but let's make him a small forward. Unless his rating goes down, but does it? I don't know. Where is he? Did it, I don't think it went down. I don't know if it, it might have stayed the same. But he's a 76 overall now, which is pretty good. Um, so I'll take that. Team relocation. We might get into that in another episode. But I'm, I'm going to ask you guys once again, in fact, I'll make a straw, I'll make a straw poll, um, I'll put the link in the comment section and in the description box down below. You guys need to hit that straw poll up. Pretty much I'm just going to ask you guys, do you want me, because I asked you guys before, but I didn't really get a clear understanding of really what you guys wanted to do, because some of you guys wanted me to relocate, some of you guys wanted me to stay in Indiana, but, um, you know, design some new uniforms and arena and you know, just do a team, uh, a new team brand thing. So uh, pretty much um, in the straw poll, I want you guys to um, either vote on me to relocate the Indiana Pacers or to do a team brand where we just pretty much, you know, obviously make you new uniforms, design a new arena um, and all that good stuff, um, a new logo and things like that. Or would you just want me to, you know, leave everything as it is um, you know, stay in Indiana, be the Indiana Pacers, don't make new, new uniforms, don't make a new arena, just stay the same. Three options, vote in the straw poll down below, um, and let's keep simulating until the Detroit Pistons game. We are just catching L's, finally a win. How did, the other day, alright, I was watching the Miami Heat versus the Brooklyn Nets. Uh, I'll, I'll let coach deal with this. I was watching, and by the way, Lavoy Allen is our backup power forward. That's not good. I mean, Lavoy Allen, he's a, he's a decent player, but I don't know if he's a great backup. We might have to look after another power forward. But anyway, I was watching the Brooklyn Miami game. First of all, these guys, the referees were not calling any fouls on, on the Heat. It was crazy. Like, um, Amari Stoudemire got hacked. Dwayne Wade got hacked. Joe Green was getting hacked. Goran Draghi got hacked. No, no call, man. It was crazy. Um,. We, why can't we win? We seriously cannot win a game right now. We are get, why? I don't understand. And Paul George is healthy as well. We just keep taking these L's, man. Kenneth Freed, you're, you're healthy, which is good. Why can't we win a game? This episode's gone on for about almost 10 minutes, but we cannot win a game. I'm gonna have to play a game to just get, I mean, the team chemistry is all right, but we can't win. We, we, we're gonna have to make a trade right now. We can't be losing to the Bucks. Then again, the Golden State Warriors lost to the Bucks. Wait, I thought we'll. God damn, I thought we were gonna play the Detroit Pistons. Turns out I simulated and we freaking lost. Why can't we win a game? Where are we now? We're, we're 17 and 16. And we freaking were 9 and 0 to start the season. I don't understand. I don't get it. I don't get it, man. I freaking don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Um, how's Paul George playing? 26 points, 10 rebounds. I mean, this guy's balling. And I guess we just don't have that next player. We don't have that that other player to to get us over the. I don't know, man. We just don't have a player to help us. So Ellis. Let's see what you're worth on the auction house, man. On the auction house? No, we're not playing my team. See what you're worth on the block. On the on the trade block. We can get Derek Rose. This guy's an 80 overall. Um, I would love to get Derek Rose. I, lo I like Derek Rose. I feel so bad for Derek Rose in real life, but yeah. Um, Ellis, I'm gonna get rid of you just because of your contract. And if we wanna sign a good free agent. I think it's got to be, but I I want someone good. Like I want a one year play. I want a one year contract. 
Or just a, or just a trade like, I mean, it's just a stupid trade though. But I want to free up cap space. Who were some players that are on one year contracts um, that I wouldn't mind to get? Obviously, you know, LeBron, Durant, Drummond. I, I, I like to get some of these guys. Um, you know, in real life, this isn't even a, it's not even a, um, an unrealistic, uh, trade to go after Dwight Howard or, or Hassan Whiteside, because you know, in real life, these guys have been rumoured to, uh, to leave, because the Heat don't have enough cap space to sign Hassan Whiteside in free agency next year, unless, you know, uh, what's his name, Dwayne Wayne wants to take another pay cut, and my bad if I sound a little bit sick, I do have a cold right now, but, yeah. Who do I want to give up? Like, do I want to give up Kenneth Farid because we just got him? I don't know about that. I don't know who I want to give up from this team. I do want to give up Mike Miller, but he's not worth anything. And I'll, I'll give up Lavoie. Neither of these guys are worth anything. Who is worth something to the, uh... The only guy that's worth anything is Miles Turner, but I don't want to give up Miles Turner. Um, all right, I, we can, what if we gave up the New York Knicks and the Pacers first round pick and just some second round picks as well? Hmm, I don't think they're willing to do this. Um, we'll take your Raptors. We'll take your Raptors first round pick and we'll give up a Knicks one. And some second round picks. More second round picks maybe? This is so annoying. I hate, I hate, I hate making trades when you have to propose them. But I just don't get any good trades for Monte Ellis. That are on a one, like I don't mind this Derrick Rose trade. Teaming up Paul George and Derrick Rose, they can talk about their injuries. And uh, see how they... I don't know what I'm saying. But seriously, man. I just want... I just want that one year... Con okay, let's let's just look at... Um, D-Rose. Like... <sighs> comment down below. Comment down below if I should make a trade giving up Monte Ellis for Derrick Rose. If so... I don't know, man. I Okay, I want you guys to comment down below. Who should I give up for... What if I got DeAndre Jordan? What if I got DeAndre Jordan, actually? Actually, what if I freaking got DeAndre Jordan? For... Monte Ellis. But then again, DeAndre... DeAndre isn't on a uh, isn't on a one year contract. In fact, he's on a three year, sixty three mil contract, which is a lot. Um, I'll, I'll try Hassan Whiteside and then I'll end the episode. But I want you guys to comment down below who should I trade Monte Ellis for? And I'm looking for a one year contract and a player that I might want to keep as well. Um. So let's say we get Deng. Uh, but, nah, I don't really want Deng to be. Actually, but he is on a one year contract, so he can leave us after this year. Um, Because he, he's an unrestricted free agent. But, jo uh, Birdman, he's on a pretty big contract. And why won't the trade go through? Two million? We can work with that. Two million. We can definitely work with that. So we would give up. Um, Joseph Young, you would give me Josh McRoberts, the Pacers would have too many players, and then we give up, not Lavoy Allen, Mike Miller, 183k, are you freaking kidding me right now, we're already set at shooting guard, what? How? How does this involve? 
I'm just checking the recording. This has gone on for 24 minutes. God damn. How does this involve Paul George morale going down? Like, I don't understand. It's got nothing to do with Paul George. Man, are you serious right now? Okay. Um. Lavoy. I just need a... See, it's just the problem with the salary, man. The salary is not looking good. Unless uh, I don't want to, do, I don't want to give up Miles Turner. That's the problem. So I don't know what to do with Monte. I'm gonna end the episode right here because I'm, I'm, I'm. I need your help right now. I need your help. I don't know what to do with Monte. So. I guess I'll leave it up to you guys. Comment down below, what should I do with Monte? I want to trade him. I want a good player for him. But I want a one-year contract. Or just a player that I might want to keep, like a Derrick Rose or something. But I don't know what I'm doing, man. And now we're going to have to talk to Paul George or something. Oh, simply business. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.